Welcome to another episode of Mixing with the Geek. Today, I'm showcasing a drink I created inspired by our episode on Herb Albert's classic, whipped cream and other delights. I call it a taste of honey, and it's a perfect match for the album. To start, we're gonna rim a margarita glass with honey and then dip in sugar. I'm using a spatula here. I'm just gonna ever so slightly run the lip of this glass through the honey. A nice little light coat. Now, I'm gonna dip it in some sugar. I'm using like a brown granular sugar here. It's gonna give a nice texture. Shake off the excess. Oh, look nice, look at that. Now we're gonna set the glass aside. Now we're gonna fill a blender with about a cup or so of crushed ice. Next, we add an ounce and a half of white tequila, an ounce and a half of pineapple juice, a half an ounce of fresh lemon juice, and finally, a half an ounce of honey mix. To make the honey mix, simply stir together equal parts honey and hot water until the honey is dissolved. Bottle and keep in the fridge. This helps to dilute the honey and make it easier to mix. Okay, now we're gonna flash blend this mixture with the blender. A couple pulses will do. Now we're gonna grab our glass from before, pour the mixture in here. Now don't worry if you have a little bit left over because you can save this, put it in a shot glass and drink it when no one's looking. Now we're gonna take some whipped cream and finally we're gonna dust with some cinnamon and a little bit of nutmeg. And there you have a taste of honey. Mmm. Oh boy, that is good. Oh, that is... That is definitely some whipped cream and other delights. I, I really like this drink. If you're curious, I used a cream whipper. This thing is a versatile tool. You can make all sorts of different whipped toppings. You can add flavors to your whipped cream. And the best part is that you don't even have to mix the cream. You just pour it right in there, add the gas, boom, you're ready. Well, I hope you enjoy making your own and be sure to check out the album review if you haven't already. I am your Vinyl Geek and I'll catch you on the flip side. Let's take a little more. Sip.